welcome back to the vlog. I'm so like, what the heck? The lighting's kind of weird. Okay, I'm so happy to be back. I actually lost my camera for the last couple of weeks and just found it in my car two days ago. So we are back vlogging. I missed you guys, I missed uploading. It's been like three weeks, but anyway, today is Tuesday. I'm sorry if you can hear my dogs eating in the background, but you guys are used to it by now. Today's Tuesday, I had clinic today and then I had a facial afterwards. It was the follow up after my second chemical peel. My skin has been doing so good. I don't really know if you can see on camera, but it's been doing amazing. It's really glowy. I feel like my, um, sir, are you okay? Um, I feel like my pigment, seriously. I feel like my pigmentation has improved a lot. So yes, I got my dogs are like crazy. But anyway. Did you guys hear that? That's Camber. He literally takes a ball in his mouth and just swings it back and forth. He's so excited. Honey, let's not do that right now, okay? Let's not do that right now. Okay, so my Esthetician gave me a little gift and I'm gonna open it and then I got my vitamins in and I actually got my scrubs in I haven't picked them up from my front door yet, but if you guys follow me on TikTok, which I think all of you do um, My I ordered mandala scrubs last week and they just came in it took so long for them to come in But anyway, let's open this A little ornament it says ho 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 If you can see it Anyway <laughs> A candle. It's an interesting smelling candle. It's cranberry, but it's it's sour. Anyway. Oh, eye patches. This is my favorite brand for eye patches. It's patch patchology. I'm so excited. I'm gonna put these in the fridge and probably put them on tomorrow. And then a kombucha microbiome leave on mask with pre, pro, and postbiotics for all skin types. Okay, fun. There's also some candy in here, like some Hershey's Kisses and candy canes. Cute. I will definitely try that. I'm gonna put the eye patches in the fridge because I've been elevating my morning routine and I feel like this will just be the chair on top. So it's weird to see myself in the camera. I need to make dinner. I think that Oh my god. I think that I'm going to make this Kite Hill ravioli because it will be literally so easy with some pesto and then I'll make a salad too. That sounds so yummy. I'm so excited. It's currently like 7.30 so I need to get started on my nighttime routine and then I also want to show you guys my Christmas decorations because I'm so sad. I wanted to like do a decorate with me for Christmas, but I couldn't find my camera, so I couldn't record it, and I just decorated this past weekend. So anyway, I'll give you guys a little tour of my Christmas decorations. They're so cute. Okay, while my dogs are outside, I wanted to show you guys my Christmas decorations. This is our Christmas tree. I'm obsessed with it. It's so cute. Uh, we just got it this weekend, and it has, we have like personalized items on it, and then Oh, you can see me in there. And then I just have kind of like a metallic color going on. I don't know, I've had these decorations forever, but this star is seriously so old, like the bottom broke off, but I just think it's kind of cute and I've kept it. These are our stockings. These are originally from Target, but again, I got these like four years ago. They do light up, I just haven't turned them on. And then this is our mantle piece. I'm obsessed, I love it. I also have these cute little um, pillows on each chair, but this so this chair is really expensive. We got it from West Elm several years ago and the dogs get up on it during the day, so we put this pot on it so they can't do it because they get it dirty and then it shows, like you can see here. So that's why that pot is there. This is our kitchen table some cash laying around here but oh my god it's like half knocked over this is the life of a working person like your Christmas decorations just aren't perfect this I guess fell off the Christmas tree but anyway 
that is there. And then we just have a few more things. I actually made these little trolls at Thanksgiving a couple of years ago. My mother-in-law, like it's yarn. She like made this little craft for us to do and they're so cute, I love them. And then I just have a wreath up there, a few little um, like frosted um, Christmas tree things there. They're fake, but. And then I just have a Christmas tree over here and that's it. Simple, very easy, but I love it. Oh, I forgot to show you guys my sign. This is like my favorite thing ever. I've had it forever, but this little peace and joy sign that I got from Target that's up there. I just think that is the cutest thing. The lighting on my camera is so bad right now. Like, I don't know what happened. I don't know how to fix it. Dinner is ready. I just made a salad with lettuce, green peppers, cucumbers, red onions. I added a little bit of tofu in there and then I make like a garlic olive oil um, sauce as the dressing. We have some ravioli with the vegan kale pesto from Trader Joe's. I made myself some carbonated water. I'm watching the new episode of Gossip Girl on like the reboot episode. So I'm having myself a night. Hi guys. It is Wednesday night. I'm slinging around a pair of scissors. Don't do that. Um, I have been the worst logger. I'm gonna put you down. I know this is a bad angle. I do apologize. I have some packages that I wanted to open with you guys. Um, one of them is for my husband, but I'm gonna open it because I know what it is. Every year his school sends a gift from this company called Harry and David, and it's a very nice gift, but we do not um, eat dairy or eggs or anything like that. You guys know that. So we don't use it every year. And I'm like, oh, this is such a waste. Not for you, Siri. So that's what I'm unboxing now. Oh God, it's popcorn. Okay, that's different. It used to be like a thing of chocolate. Moon moose. Ah! Premium popcorn. Where are the ingredients? Bunch of them a gift of the finest indulge in the finest caramel popcorn yeah cocoa butter milk milk chocolate it's like so sad every year they send this to us and we don't eat it maybe there is a, a regular that's okay now We'll gift it to a friend. And then I just got a package from Amazon that is just, um, sorry, I can't speak. It's just shampoo. I got a, um, my hair is naturally brunette, as is probably quite obvious. And so I have to use, I usually use a purple shampoo, but my hairstylist actually recommended that I use a blue shampoo because sometimes my hair gets orangey. So I'm gonna try out this No Orange Shampoo by Fanola. It's extra blue pigment. So I'll try that. It's not hair wash day though, so I'll try that another time. Good morning, friends. It is a Thursday morning, driving to work. I'm very tired. My alarm this morning scared the crap out of me. I thought it was the weekend. I hate when that happens. When you're like, oh, it's Saturday. Why is my alarm going off? So anyway, I was tricked. It is Thursday. I'm in clinic today. We're seeing patients. We still have a reduced schedule though because um, of Epic. And years. So I'd be lying if I said that I did not want to do this today because I, I really don't want to go to work. Um, I really miss having some days off during the week. 
it's getting me to work Monday through Friday. It's so much. And it's really hard to do anything outside of work. It's really hard to like tackle house chores. It's really hard to like spend time with other people outside of work, especially because I have a very, I, have, I like to go to the gym. I like to cook my meals. Um, you know, like we'll go out on the weekends, but I don't like to really go out during the week. I don't like to eat out a ton. So that's hard. It's hard to like go home and go to the gym and cook your meals and make sure your house is clean because I feel like I can't go to sleep at night if my house isn't clean and like read and have other hobbies. So anyway, I'm sure you guys all know this because most of us are working individuals, but there's always obviously give and take. I don't necessarily miss the 12 hour shifts and I definitely don't miss like the hospital work, but I miss, um, some days off, you know. So, going to work today because we gotta make that money, baby. Okay, so a little update it's Thursday night, i.e., the Christmas Eve of the week. I had to run home instead of going to the gym because um, my husband wasn't able to come and let the dogs out this evening, which he usually can like let them out in the afternoon or something. We have a dog yard, but our yard is a mess right now, and they're bringing so much dirt in that they have to stay inside during the day because we left them outside for a part of the day yesterday with water and stuff of course and it was a nice day outside and camper got over the fence and i found him like frolicking around the neighborhood so anyway they've lost their privileges so i lost my train of thought so i had to come straight home instead of going to the gym and i'm thinking now that i'm home i don't think i'm going back out to the gym I think I'm just gonna do kind of like a cardio based workout here because I have some things I need to get done. I actually booked a Pilates class for tomorrow and then for Saturday. So I'm gonna do that because I usually take a rest day on Saturday, but now I'm gonna do Pilates. I recently, I don't know, actually probably haven't told you guys this, but I signed up for a Pilates studio near me because I've just been recently wanting to um, change up my workout routine because I love the gym but I hate going to the gym when I get off because there's so many people there so it would be nice for me to have somewhere else that I could go a couple of days a week and not have to worry about the chaos at the gym so I'm doing that tomorrow and then Saturday so tonight we're gonna cultivate a vibe I have to empty the dishwasher I'm gonna kind of like clean up my house for the weekend because Tomorrow's Friday and I could not be more excited that tomorrow's Friday like it has been such a long week. So let's do some chores. We are headed out the door. I have to wash my face, wash some gloves out. We're headed out for the day really. I put on Love Actually which is arguably the best Christmas movie ever. My dogs will not like leave me alone. There you go. And then I'm literally just popping in these mini vegetable samosas to into the oven um, because I'm really hungry. I thought I wasn't going to eat dinner tonight because I ate lunch pretty late and I wasn't hungry when I got home. But now it's 8.30 and I'm hungry. So we're going to do this and then I'm going to clean my floors. Hello, friends. I just finished clinic this morning. I'm on my way to get a coffee and I'm eating my leftover Chipotle in the car. I just really want an iced coffee. Oh my God, my camera's about to die. I just really want an iced coffee from this one place that I haven't had in forever. So I'm grabbing it on my lunch break, then I'm gonna go back, do some work, have a Pilates class this evening. I think it's at five. We're having a good day. My patients were very pleasant this morning. I had a great time. So let's go. I just got home. I grabbed myself a oat milk latte with a little bit of almond syrup and you guys it is so good i'm obsessed i've never this is like my favorite local coffee shop but i've never gotten the almond syrup there before i just saw it today and was like i have to try that it is amazing 10 out of 10 recommend it's from um provisions in wesley chapel florida if you are from around the tampa area but anyway my day is not over i just um that office that i work out on fridays is so crowded like there's really no place for me i don't have an office there so it's really no place for me to do work so i was like i'm going on my lunch break and then i need to do i'll do stuff at home because 
I need to um, chart prep for Monday. I need to follow up on some tests and imaging that I have like in my basket and then we'll go from there. But yeah, I, I it, it was too much going on there. So we're gonna finish working from home. Good morning, happy Saturday. What is my dog doing over there? I am just sitting on the couch with my beverages, about to watch some YouTube. It's 9.09. Oh my God, I keep forgetting to charge my camera. I'm gonna watch some YouTube, maybe make some breakfast, and then I have a Pilates class at 11. My Pilates class last night was really good. It was a jump class, which was fun. <clears throat> I have some eye patches on, and we're having a morning. I love having like these slow mornings since I work all week. It's so nice. 